fashion content creator on Instagram, YouTube and TikTok and today I have a collective haul for you so this is stuff that I have gotten basically from PR or bought in the past two to three months I'd say and I wanted to share it with you. The sponsor of today's video is eBay. So eBay has just launched their authenticity guarantee for sneakers in Australia which means we can now buy authenticated sneakers from the US with free shipping. Essentially the sneakers are verified by a third party which means that we're receiving legitimate products, there are no fakes and this also provides protection for sellers. This is the box. That was just a recreation, I already opened this. So when you purchase sneakers that have an authenticity guarantee on eBay, which will have a blue check mark or tick on the shoe listing to indicate it qualifies for this authenticity guarantee. I chose the Nike Air Max Uptempo 95s in red, black and white. Inside we have this eBay authentication card. And basically this card gives instructions on how to scan your NFC tag, which is essentially a tag on the left shoe of the sneaker. You can scan this tag with your smartphone and a link pops up and on that link it provides you a more detailed explanation of the um, authenticity of your sneaker. This tag also makes it easy to relist the sneakers in the future. And if your phone doesn't detect the NFC tag, one, try taking your phone case off, and if that doesn't work, you can also download the app Decode. I'll provide a link below to eBay so you can shop newly authenticated sneakers. eBay also has access to over 100,000 listings from the US, which means that we can get our hands on the latest sneakers that aren't available in Australia. Next up, I have this bag from Ruiz. I don't know how to pronounce this brand name, but I received this yesterday in the mail and I'm so excited. And it comes in the cutest blue box. It also has a little dust bag in there as well. But we have this beautiful like lime green croc, croc skin bag. I can't get over it. The color is so cute. I'm so here for mini bags because I honestly don't have that many. Definitely going to be getting some use out of this. I can't wait to style it. As for some clothes, I got two pieces from the brand Nuff or Nuff. I'm not sure how to pronounce this either. But first up, I have these really cool stockings. They're like a tights material but it's actually stockings, which is super cool. I am yet to style these because I feel like styling printed stockings can be quite difficult. I'm trying to find the perfect skirt to pair this with. I love the print of it, and I have a top that actually matches this so perfectly. And next up, I also have these pants, which I'm so obsessed with. So I actually wore these to Fashion Week, and I'll include it on the screen, and they have these cutouts. And what's really cool is they have these metal details, which basically connects each part of the pants, and it's on one side. The only thing is, is that they fall out so easily, like I think I lost maybe four of these just like by wearing it out to fashion week, but they do come with like extra ones when you like get them. So I have some more in the bag, but what I'm thinking is I might just super glue them shut because they untwist really easily, which is why it falls apart. But other than that, the actual quality of the pants is like really great. It even has a cool customized um, button thingy, I don't know what it's called. And like little ones at the back as well. So my friend Rowie or Rowie Singh, you might know her on Instagram. She's a makeup artist, but she just released a collection with Mountain and Mood. And oh my god, so stunning. So first up, I have this ring. It is so beautiful. It has like a little gold tiger or something or leopard jaguar on it. I don't know exactly. And then I also got these earrings, which are so stunning. They have little flowers on there. Roy has such good taste, I'm obsessed. I also wanted to show the box because this is just so cute as well. Excuse me. And then, oh, I got a surprise package from Minga London. Um, they sent me this really cute little like mushroom crop top and it just has Minga on it, which is the brand name. So cute, I love it. I don't know if this happens to anyone else, but like I literally won't get a package for maybe like two weeks and then suddenly I'll get like five on one day. And that's what happened this week, so. <laughs> I also got these jeans which are really cool. They're very like 90s, 2000s style with like the different tones and um, cutouts pieced together. Lastly, they also sent me this necklace which I'm wearing now. And it's so cute, like these beaded necklaces are so in. Also, I'm having an eczema flare up which is why I'm very red, if you were wondering. Okay, this is so random but I've been so obsessed with Kathmandu lately. I was doing some work with Kathmandu and we went foraging which was so fun. But we basically got like fully decked out in Kathmandu. I'm not going to show you everything. What I have been wearing heaps is their puffer jacket. When I tell you that this is so warm because it is winter in Australia, it doesn't get that cold and like today it's really quite actually warm. But when it does get cold here, it gets cold and like windy. 
So I have been wearing this every day, even at home. And it's actually so cute. And like, I love this color because I've just been wearing a lot of pink lately, but it also comes with this little bag. So you can basically just scrunch the whole puffer jacket into this. I genuinely stand Kathmandu as a brand because all of their products are sustainable and ethical. They make genuinely like good quality stuff. There's that. I also have a fleece that I've been wearing heaps as well. So I have two pairs of sunglasses. Oh, actually, I have three pairs of sunglasses, but I'll show you two now. Oh my god, Prada sent me sunglasses. Excuse me, what? I'm on, I'm on PR for Prada, but I got these sick sunnies. And like, I love the packaging of it all as well. It's just... It's so exciting! I got these sunnies. I can't remember the exact model, but I'll put it on the screen or down below. It has like a bit of a geometric side. And... Oh, so far. Let me put them on for you. I'm also like always so paranoid when I wear designer sunglasses because I'm scared I'm gonna ruin them. Which like I don't often ruin or lose my things, but I just get paranoid anyway. I got these Lispec sunnies and they're in collaboration with Christopher Kane. And here are the sunnies. It's actually quite similar to the Prada ones that I just showed you in terms of the rectangular frame, but they're red and these are so fun. I'm wearing a lot of rings, but I just got this ring, which is from Heart of Bone, and I actually have another Heart of Bone ring here, which I've had for ages, but basically, my friend Elle, she did a shoot for them, and they sent her this ring as like a thank you, but it ended up being too big, and it's actually too big on me as well, but I kind of just put another ring here, and it's not too bad, but yeah, they said that she could give it to me, and they'd send her a new one. Um, so now I have two Heart of Bone rings, and it's so fun, and if you're wondering, they're both made out of different metals, so I believe this one's just stainless steel and it's like anti-tarnish as well and then this one is something else, I can't remember. I don't know how to describe rings, I don't know much about like proper jewellery terminology. And my faves at IMGR sent me a package. I love them. I'm so excited to be back on IMGR PR because I got on it once and then I just did it for like years and then the past two collections they put me back on the PR list. So yeah, okay. This is a top that I have been wearing so much since I've gotten it. But I styled this with my Nuff pants that I showed earlier. But honestly, like this just suits every outfit, I swear to God. It has a mandarin collar and it's a crop top and a scoop neck. But these are like little strappy straps that you tie around your waist and it's like so hot. And then I also got this skirt, which I haven't worn yet just because it's been way too cold here. But it comes with like a little shell belt, which is over there. I can't be bothered to get it, I'm sorry. You can just imagine like little shells. Yeah, that's basically what it is. And then I got these pants, which are so sick. Um, they basically have like laces all the way down and it flares out a bit at the end, but these are so flattering as well. Um, in terms of IMG sizes, so I'm normally an Australian medium or a 10, but IMG, I usually always go down to a small. But for these pants, if you're interested in getting them, I would get your normal size because this one does run true to size for once, I don't know why, but I can still fit these, like, and they still fit well, like, and you'd probably still fit them as well, but it's just more comfortable if you got your actual size, I reckon. I love, like, the little detailing on here, like, this part, and then also how the lace stops here, and then another set goes down to the bottom. I have two more pieces for them. I wore this together. I have this little fairy top. It is so cute and so flattering. I wear it with these very Y2K jeans. They're bit low rise and it like ruches down here. Is ruche the right word? I think it is. But yeah, or you can like make it come up a bit if you don't want that. Um, they're a bit of a jeggings material and I actually didn't pick this out but I still think it's like cute and it really suits the white top. And like as a look, it's very Bratz, early 2000s vibes. It, they're quite simple, there's nothing really to show them. I got these pair of shoes from Flat Apartment. Like can I just say the packaging was so nice. Um, this was a box and it has flat apartment there. I don't know if you'll be able to see it because it's kind of in like an iridescent clear font. It comes with a dust bag and then also like this little note which is just so aesthetically pleasing. But the actual shoes, they're like strappy sandals and they're so unique. It has like this outer bit. It kind of looks like a flipper <laughs> but I feel like it makes it super unique. I have these Crocs. They're white platform Crocs and I am so obsessed with these. Like I literally wear them all the time. I'm very much a platform croc girl. I don't know if I'm into like the shorter crocs, but I customized this at a PR agency. They had a crocs event and it was so fun. Like look at all my gibbets. I'm glad they've come back in style with the platforms because I'm so here for it. I have a few pieces from Shop Collie. Let me button this up because I wore this the other day. I think this is my favorite piece, but I got these pants. 
and they're so fun. Like, I love this print and the colours, it's just the same thing on the back. So cute, I don't know what else to say about this, but oh, I have a discount code, I'll put it on the screen because I don't remember what it is. And it'll also be linked below with like all of the links to the actual pieces. I also have this little white crop top and it's like a holder neck crop top, but it comes with these little sleeves. So I like, I'm obsessed with like the little arm cast, but these ones you can like wrap around the tops of your arms and it's so cute. There's a, there's another one. <laughs> As you can tell, I was having a sleeves moment because I also got this one with blue sleeves and it's just like an asymmetrical crop top as well and then the matching blue sleeves these pieces are super like insta baddie type of fits y2k girl um but i'm here for it it's so cute i have this brown heart crop top and it has like that ruching that's really in right now as well i don't know if ruching is the right word but you know what i mean like you can visually see it i guess so this is like the last of my clothes stuff and then i just have some beauty stuff and like a few miscellaneous items these are from asos so i was very into the beige this light yellow color you will see as i show you the rest of the pieces i got but i got the cutest little like tiered puffy dress i don't even know what you call this i wore this on a picnic with my friends and like it was just the right vibe for it we sat in barangaroo reserve which is like one of my favorite parks in sydney this little matching hat with it excuse me it's so cute i'm obsessed and then i paired it with these sunnies which i also got from asos i've been so into like the big frame sunnies like the very 70s vibes i have other ones that are like more square like which are super cute <laughs> and then lastly i haven't worn these pants yet but I have the same colour <laughs> pads and they're just super flowy and long and these would look so cute with like heeled boots and they would make your legs look very long. Let me quickly show you the miscellaneous items because I only have two things. First up is a book. I made it onto book PR. I'm so here for this. So this releases on the 2nd of July I think which will have already passed by the time this video comes out I believe. It's by an American Australian Asian author. And I'm very excited to read this. It's called She is Haunted by Paige Clark. And then I also have these little phone charms that my friend Tonya made. So I bought this one for her and it's so cute. It's pink. It's a little bit dirty because I've had it on there for a while. But it's like super sturdy. Like this has, this is not going to break. She really puts her time into making sure that it doesn't break. And like is it flimsy like a lot of other brands are. And then she also made me this one as a gift and a little ring. But I don't think she sells them. So this is the other one and it's very like my necklace vibes so cute and this one comes with the actual like phone charm so she tried out two different designs okay i've also made it to like makeup and skincare pr like lately i don't know why but i'm so here for it as well i'll start out with the ordinary so deseem i don't know how to pronounce that either but which is like the parent company contacted me and they sent me some things to try so they sent me the i can't it was like a pack with these three in it they have the squalene cleanser and then hyaluronic acid and natural moisturizing factors and HA. They also sent me the 100% plant derived squalene. And lastly, we have Anastasia Beverly Hills. They sent me a whole bunch of stuff, which is like absolutely insane. First up, they sent me this matte lipstick in the color Dead Roses. It's a very beautiful, like deep red color. And then we have the clear brow gel. Oh my god, I opened this and I smelled it and it smelled like a chemical version of a lychee jelly. Waterproof gel liner. Liquid lipstick. I might have to take it out of the box. I don't know, but it's in the color Naked. Clear sparkly lip gloss. So cute. I can't wait to wear this. We have liquid glow highlighter in rose gold. Pro pencil eyeshadow primer and color corrector. In, and it says base 2. Brow definer in blonde. Blonde dip brow pomade. I asked for blonde brow stuff just because I have bleached eyebrows. And lastly, I'm so excited about this guys. We have an eyeshadow palette or pigment palette. That's what they call this. And it is just so colorful. So up my alley. Like I'm so here for trying out colors with like my makeup looks as you can tell. So I'm very excited to use this. Look at that. These colors. I'm obsessed. So that's the end of my whole video. Thank you so much for watching and make sure to check out the links to everything down below. I'll have all the details and link as much as I can. I want to say thank you again to eBay for sponsoring this video and check out their sneaker authentication guarantee process because it's such an awesome feature that they've implemented in their business. And also it's so great that you can get free shipping now from sneakers from literally the US. And I'll have that all linked below as well. It'll be at the top of the description box. Check me out on Instagram, which is tarachandra underscore and TikTok, which is also so Tara Tanger underscore.